Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Um, today I'm conducting an electrical installation conditioning report on a property in Plymouth. Um, on this one, things aren't exactly perfect, and I'll show you what I mean. So, we have the main income meter tails, which are providing the power af after this uh, meter. And it's quite taut and not secured to the wall. It's just been cable tied to the main incoming supply from the national grid. Yes, it's got an 80 amp uh, fuse fitted because that's what it says there. So I have to take that as gospel. But inside the fuse board, we have a steeple fuse board with some YLX uh, miniature circuit breakers. Um, these YLX uh, breakers shouldn't really be in a steeple fuse board. Um, they haven't been tested by the manufacturer steeple to work in their consumer units. Um, so therefore it wouldn't meet the manufacturer's guidelines. So that's one thing wrong. We have a blue cable which is coming from this fuse spur that is not clipped to the wall at all. And it's just going straight through the cavity wall through an air brick to the outside. We'll find out what that's doing in a moment. All the cables here right next to the boiler. No trunking lid on. There is a trunking lid there, but whether it fits at this stage, I won't know. And then you've got all these, which is obviously these these are appliances, so it's not covered by my report, but that's not exactly healthy being near um gas, which is a boiler. I'll show you the rest of the property. These down lights here in this kitchen are not fire rated. Um and they have to be fire rated now to comply with the current wiring regulations. And the downlights in the bathroom are not fire rated. However, these are IP rated. These ones here with covers on. But this one definitely isn't. Covers completely missing. So water ingress can get in there. And the ceiling is not above 2.4 meters. So that does not comply. This would have once been a working fire. Unfortunately, can no longer be a working fire because you've got sockets fitted. Um, that's why that, that block of wood there is to block the chimney. Um, I can imagine this is for the TV because there's no power on this wall and there's the TV bracket. So those cables come for the air brick are merely going sideways, clipped direct, straight to a floodlight and a junction box, which then goes to a, a secondary floodlight. Not very clever install. And the last one goes to this outside socket. Once again, sat flapping in the wind. This is just a visual uh, look at the stage. This is part one, stay tuned for part two. Bye for now.